Hey guys, what's going on? It's Crystal Collects and in today's video, I'll be opening up the Korean version of Shield. So I have not yet opened this on my channel and yes, it is half of Sword and Shield base set in English. Of course, today we'll just be focusing on Shield. The other half will be Sword. Both sets actually came out on February 7th, 2020. So over a year ago already. Shield by itself already has 75 cards, including the secret rares. So of course, half the size of regular Sword and Shield base set. No worries though, there's a lot of uh, beautiful cards in the set, especially some favorites from the Gala region like Morbico. We even have Snorlax. There's Sableye, Torkoal, of course, Zamazenta, and a couple of trainers, such as the Team Yell Grunts and also Marnie. So if you're looking for Marnie in particular, she'll be uh, included in the Japanese and Korean version of Shield. So please keep that in mind. There's also three lovely gold cards, including the Metal Saucer, the Quick Ball, and of course, the Zamazenta gold card. So definitely, hopefully, we'll pull that today. One thing to keep in mind for Korean booster boxes, you are not guaranteed a secret rare. I repeat, you are not guaranteed a secret rare. So hopefully, we are lucky to pull something today. Before we get started, please make sure to hit that like button and also subscribe for more multi-language Pokemon content. Let's get going. All right, so we have the booster box of Shield, also known as Sirido in Korean. This is also known as S1H. I believe Sword is S1W. So there's the two letters disting distinguishing between the two sets. Of course, a Sword and Shield box. So you're going to see the plastic covering over the whole box. And of course, this booster box has 30 booster packs with five cards per pack. I'm just going to uh, quickly cut into this and show you guys also the licensing, just to confirm they're real. You know, I just like to do that in every video. Because I know some people are still um, getting familiar with Korean booster boxes. There are fakes out there, but usually they won't have any licensing. As you can see on the back of this box, it says Pokemon Korea Incorporated, and of course also licensed by Nintendo. So here's some still specs. Still a lot of fakes out there. Still a lot of fakes out there. Um, I, in particular, Astonishing Volt Tackle. I think also known as Sky, Hall, Sky High Volt Tackle. Anchon Wee Volt Tackle. Thank you, cameraman. You're welcome. So we have our beautiful packs featuring just Zamazenta. Again, uh, there's two different sets, Sword and Shield. Of course, Sword will have Zacian, and I did open that on my channel previously, but it's about time we give some Zamazenta some love too. So, But again, the nice thing about this set, it has Marnie. So if you're a big Marnie fan, this is a good set to open. We have Dubwool, not Champions Path Dubwool. Galarian Ponyta, Rare Candy, S Super Bon Bon, and, and I think French. Oh, and you have Galarian Obstagoon. Actually, I don't even recognize that art. It's been a while since seeing that one. I feel like there's just been so much Obstagoon in other um, sets, like Darkness Ablaze, Champion's Path, so much hollows of it, but no um, any VMAX or V card of it. So that's really interesting. We have Mawel Hitmonchan. I think Hitmonlee's French name is Kikli, which is really interesting. Again, I like to repeat some of the names because I always find them fascinating how they pick certain names, especially Hop in Spanish is Paul. I know you've probably heard me say this a thousand times unless you're new to the channel, then welcome. We have Scorbunny, Rhyhorn, Dotler. Oh, an Orbeetle right after one another. And oh, 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 wow. There you go. We got our secret rare today. Dumbo. First pull too. We got Damanbo, also known as Snorlax. Very nice on the Korean cardstock. Of course, this will look a bit different from the Japanese version. The, the texture is a bit thicker. And of course, on the back, we have the international backings. Whereas on the Japanese card, it's a little bit, it's, it has its own backing. And of course, the secret rare is going to be 66 out of 60. So it's above the number 60. We have our lovely Marnie sleeves, just because I know Marnie is in this set. So there we go. Hit the like button for Jamanbo, also known as Snorlax. Really nice. I can tell the quality of the secret rares are definitely improving um, as we go by generation. But do oh. keep in mind. Not guaranteed. I always got to say that because I just, I don't want people to think, you know, when they're getting a Korean booster box and they don't pull any like secret rare, you guys are not getting scammed. Just South Korea um, advertise things differently over there compared to Japan. And again, these booster boxes will be much more affordable. It is, it is a good alternative compared to Japanese booster boxes. That's one of the reasons. And of the other reason, of course, is the different card stock. It's not as glossy, but it is pretty smooth, actually. I can tell the quality of the cards definitely improved. I like to call them sticky cards because sometimes the cards stick together a little bit more. And with Copper Raja, definitely saw that as a promo in some of the English blisters before. But um, yeah, that's one big difference with the Korean uh, packs or Korean cards versus the Japanese cards. Also, too, as you can see, there are yellow borders versus the Japanese cards which will have silver borders. And the backings, of course, are the international box. The Japanese cards have their own style going on. We have Dredna and Citrus Berry. That is a shocker, though. Right away, the Secret Word has made its appearance. You can definitely see um, a lot of the Sword and Shield booster boxes or sets are definitely much more generous with the Secret Rares. But again, I have seen boxes where there were no Secret Rares at all. For Especially example, Astonishing Volt Tackle. I did a 60 pack opening or two booster box opening nothing. and nothing at all. We have Marnie, also known as Mari in Korean. So literally 60 packs, nothing. Nothing at all. But yeah, I hope that Hollow confirms to you guys. Marnie is in this set. So if that trainer card's there, there's also the full art. Maybe I'll open up more shield so I can try to pull Marnie in Korean. I think that would be a very lovely adventure, don't you think? Kickly, <laughs> Hitmonlee. We have Dotler, Metal Saucer, and Rhydon. 
Very nice. Again, I actually, I'm starting to like the feel of the Korean cards definitely more now. And again, too, one thing I always like to say with Korean booster boxes or Korean cards in general, as soon as you pull your hollows or your V cards or your secret rares, make sure to put them in hard cases or the um, top loaders just so they don't curve. Unless you like the curvy cards. And we got another Snorlax! Very heavy of Snorlaxes in this box. Also, Snorlax is heavy as a Pokemon, so that's Jamambo. actually funny. Damanbo, yes. J Jay really loves the Korean names if you haven't noticed. I don't noticed. like the English names. I think he's actually forgetting the English names. He doesn't even that's, know the English. That's my game. <laughs> you don't even I'm know the English. Learning is so good. You know what I mean? <laughs> exactly. I tell you too. Also, I don't know if you guys noticed too. The saturation is a bit higher on this, just it's, from what I yeah, see. Yeah, look, it looks very saturated. We have Eldegoss here, Quillfish, Kufant in the rain, Aurora Energy, and Reboot. So yes, from moving forward, we're probably just gonna see V and V Max cards since we did land the secret rare. But that's really nice though. I'm happy we at least got it, and we don't have to sweat for the rest of the video, <laughs> cameraman. Yeah. Alrighty. But I wonder what the VMAXs will be. Imagine it's a Snorlax VMAX. We just get all the Snorlaxes possible. Except the rainbow, of course. You mean Jamambo? Jamambo, yes. Jamambo. For those who don't know the Korean, I'm, I'll, I'll try to say the English name too. But And in, and in Japanese, it's Kabigon. That one. Yeah, that one, right. I don't know which one I like better. I definitely am a fan of Jamambo. I feel like it's fun to say. We have Hoot Hoot, Scorbunny. We have a Vitality Ban and a Sandaconda. Not a holographic, though. But yeah, sometimes I, I've definitely noticed that over time, sometimes certain cards will be hollow in some languages and maybe not hollow in other languages. One great example is the Charizard and the Terrakion from Vivid Voltage. They're hollow in Japanese and Korean, but not in English. Very interesting there. Another Galarian Obstagoon. Again, this set's only 75 cards, so you're definitely going to see some repeats here and there, which is fine if you're definitely building a deck in Korean. If you can, if you can read the language and you want to play competitively, then that's a good... Um, thing about these Korean booster boxes if you are about getting those repeats. Whereas in English you'll find more diversity since the card lists are bigger. I'd say it's going to be double of what you see here today. I believe a uh, sword is also 75 cards in total so you have a total of 150 for the English plus probably extras because some cards will be considered uh, promos in English or in Korean Japanese. I think hop was actually considered a promo in Japanese but not in English. Oh there you go we have Mopiko. Not in English sword and shield it's going to be uh, the promo from Champion's Path the hop card I'm talking about. And we have a nice Morpico, really cute. Again, Morpico and Marnie will both be in this set. I think that's a nice pairing. Last pack of the first pile. We have not yet hit a VMAX, which is very interesting. Just V cards. Even the Seeker Rare is a V card. All right, Mawile, Chinchow. But if you do land a Seeker or VMAX, it'll be Rainbow, Lantern, and then Team Yell Grunt. And there's a nice full art to those guys in this set too. All right, second pile. Let's see what VMAXs we're gonna get. That's real interesting, unless, maybe sometimes you get one VMAX. It can happen and you just get more V cards just to compensate for that. It can happen. Copperaja, again, another Copperaja. That's a, that's a very saturated card. It's a very, yeah, indeed, very, very saturated. Alrighty, I, I definitely wanna see the VMAXs because they definitely look very saturated as well mm -hmm. compared to the English cards. And after uh, also looking at Japanese cards too, in comparison. All right, Citrus Berry. Few more packs. Sorry guys for the noise. Some people moving in and out. One day I'll be in an apartment where there's no sound. Just me. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> and, right. and cameraman. Alright, we have Wulu. We have a Zigzagoon, Galarian Zigzagoon, Blipbug, Dredna. Oh wow, there you go! <laughs> so many Demon Bulls or Demon Snorlax. Ball. Very nice in Korean. This is so cool. Snorlax VMAX, also known as Demon Ball VMAX. Buimax. Buimax. <laughs> So in Korean, there's no V. They just pronounce it as Bui, like B-U-I. So and Jamambo I... Bui Maximida. <laughs> there you go. Which means this is Snorlax V Max in Korean. Jamambo Bui, Bui Maximida. Maximida. <laughs> Sorry, guys. We have too much fun with these languages. We, I mean, we have fun. You know, what I mean? you that's, know that's what it's about. That's you know, Oranguru holographic. Oh my god. But yeah, there you go. All the Snorlaxes except the rainbow. Just get up. Oh, I guess open another box. Either oh, there goes the scissors. <laughs> Either get the Marnie full art or the um, rainbow. There's even rainbow Marnie in the set too, which is really cool. Of Gossifleur, Sandaconda, and Quick Ball. All right, I think under ten packs. Sorry, scissors. I just threw you around. Wow, how can you even count from that angle? I don't. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> uh, random also, number. the packs are way thinner compared to the English pack. So again, I'm also just making an estimation based on what I see. So I could be wrong. Middle saucer. Don't account for what I say sometimes. 
All right, what else can we get? So that's one V Max. Hopefully, we'll get one more. If hopefully. We don't. Hopefully. But I'm very happy with that V Max. Yeah, yo, that's this is more. a very, very Jamambo box. Yeah, very Jamambo heavy box. Very, very Jumambo. Which is funny because Jamambo is a very heavy Pokemon to begin on. Third Kaparaja. Uh, <laughs> Holy cow. Super saturated. <laughs> Holy elephant. <laughs> Lots of Kaparajas. All right, let's see what else we can get here. Oh, come on. There we go. Fiddly pack there. Gildeen. Chin Chow, very yellow, especially with the yellow borders. Raidan and Aurora Energy. Again, gonna be gonna Let's feel get very one different. More Please, one, I don't think we can, <laughs> unless we get another V card of Snorlax or Jamanbo V. That, that can sense. happen, but let us see. Should put Jamanbo on the schnum. box. Get a little schnum. Got uh, Wulu, Galarian, Zigzagoon, Vitality Band. Oh, no. <laughs> wow, <laughs> number four. You aren't joking. You've, you've, you've placed like a Snorlax or Jumbo like spell on this box. Now we got our fourth one. I guess hit the like button for Snorlax. You guys will probably know the name by now, Jumbo. Jumbo. We just keep saying it at this point. Jumbo. 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 Say it after me, Jumbo. Put it on the screen as a subtitle. <laughs> it's like a huge subtitle, Jumbo. I'm gonna drill it in your head. No, I'm just kidding. You guys can learn whatever you want, whatever name you want to learn for Snorlax. Galgaboogie. Oh yeah, th that's the yeah, Korean one. name of Dreadnought. So this card says like, Galaga Boogie. One Galaga Boogie. one way I like to remember that name is the fact that um it sounds like bulgogi, which is the Korean beef <laughs> dish. That's one that's one way that that's my friends the best always way remember. To remember it. If you know bulgogi, you can remember Galaga Boogie. It's also another one of those Pokemon that have completely different names in Japanese and in Korean. So it's Galaga Boogie in Korean and it's Kajirigame in Japanese. So it's very interesting. I think I always think of Kame, which is uh, Japanese for turtle. That's how I can remember oh, that yeah, too. Yeah. yeah. Even like in Dragon Ball Z, there's like someone. Kamehameha. Yeah, Kamehameha, Kame King. Yeah. Right, come, continuing, Muna, some uh, some small education for you guys. I try not to <laughs> overwhelm you all too much. I don't know if we're gonna get that second Vmax though. That's really interesting. We got oh yeah, you're due for one more. This is perfect for a Snorlax deck though, because yeah, if you're yo, if you if you're like a Jamambo fan, this is this, a box. This is this is this, this is, is a box. This is the box. All right, we have this is our second to last pack. But I just, say, I just say this, you got lucky with this box. This, Definitely. This, just so you guys know, this doesn't usually happen. And also, again... sometimes, as mentioned, you're not guaranteed a secret rare. rare. But I'd say too, with uh, Sword and Shield era boxes, there's definitely way more pulls compared to Sun and Moon boxes. Sometimes I'll be opening like 20 pack booster boxes and you get two pulls, like two GXs and not even a secret rare. Oh, oh so I guess... So you only got one VMAX. That's only one VMAX. So that can happen sometimes, guys. All right, I'll be right back with you all. All right, so on to our final review. Yes. So a very interesting box with lots of Unusual repeat hollows. Box. Here are hollows to begin. We have Marnie again. Marnie's in this set. So if you're looking for that Marnie full art, the Korean uh, or Japanese version of Shield is the set that you want to get just to repeat. Yeah. Lots of nice hollows though. Lots of copper rajas for sure. Saturated. But the biggest, the biggest one of them all, not Morpico. Morpico is one of the pulls. Is Snorlax. Remember, I kid you not. We have one, two. Dude. Three, the VMAX, oh, no, and four, net. <laughs> we have four Jamanbos or Snorlax, and we did manage to get the Seeker Rare. So I'm very, very happy about that. And Damn. look how happy Snorlax is or Jamanbo. Oh. So we got four, two Vs, one VMAX, one V full art, and then just the random That's Morpico. A lot of so it's literally the Snorlax box from Shield. No Zamazentas or Jamagenta in Korean. So yeah, yeah, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed that opening. If you did so, please make sure to hit that like button and also subscribe if you'd like to see more multi language Pokemon openings. Stay safe, everyone. We'll see you in the next video.